Oh, Graham! Yes? Graham! Yes? What did you do to my screen? I gave it some class. What do you mean you gave it some class? I gave it, you know, international sort of high quality class that you need. Rather than just postcards, you've got New Zealand emblems there. It's just giving you an international class. Everyone says, oh my god, I want to go to New Zealand. So there you go. How is that international? It's only New Zealand. You could only see New Zealand. You don't need to know about anything else. Oh yeah. Oh dear. Look at that. Graham! Yes? How does it even match? I have my... <laughs> I'm wearing a Japanese outfit against a New Zealand background. Can you please tell me how that makes sense? Japanese are fans of New Zealand. <laughs> Says who? They're the biggest fans of the, they're one of the biggest fans of the All Blacks. It's how do you know that? Stuff. And it's exactly. the Rugby World Cup is being held in Japan next year and there's a special game being played in Japan for the All Blacks. And it's all ties in. It all ties in. You can't even see my hair. Well, I had this all planned out, Graham. Well then change it. <laughs> Goodbye! Hi. The silly bugger. So this is another day in the life of a vlogger with an ever supportive, supportive partner. So I told I told Graham that I am all backed up in my incoming mail and that I have to open up some mail today. And he says, yeah, sure, go ahead, go for it. I said, well, you know, I'm gonna need at least an hour alone in the room, peace and quiet, okay, just to open up some mail. And he said, so I'll just hang out in the living room. Okay, so then I left and came back to this one. What happened to all of my postcards? Unbelievable, this guy. Unbelievable. Anyway, we are now headed into the third week of August, even though this video won't come out until much later. Well, for the past two weeks, I had rather slow mail weeks and um, I didn't receive anything this Tuesday. And then on Wednesday, I only received two pieces of mail. And it was like, oh, you know, I hope it gets better towards the end of the week. And guess what? It did. It did get better. And I also received this one. This is an official document. This is from the government. Um, so just to show you how spoiled Macau people are, ever since we had that huge casino boom with all the foreign casinos coming in and Macau started getting richer and richer, even though Macau is getting richer and richer, it doesn't mean that the residents are getting richer. The residents at one time started complaining about the huge increase in real estate you know and house rents and all of that house rent here is such a killer i live in an apartment my apartment is a good size it's in a new building but i've only got three bedrooms and my house rent is about 1350 us dollars per month right and that's just an apartment it's not even a proper house anyway local residents complained a lot about the increasing house rent and again because macau is getting richer i like to think that the government does not really know what to do with the excess money that we have so to sort of please the residents that is get them to keep quiet the government has decided to hand out money to the residents yearly and that started about, if I'm not mistaken, that started in 2008, so about 10 years ago. So right around July, August, September, the government hands out money to Macau residents. There are two levels. So if you are a temporary resident, then you don't get as much as the permanent. If you're a permanent, of course, you get higher. The money has also increased over the past few years, but it has been constant at this rate for the past three years now, if I'm not mistaken. And some locals even complain about that. Anyway, so if you are a temporary resident, the government gives you about, if I am not mistaken, 5,500 MOP. And if you are a permanent resident, you get 9,000 MOP. To be honest, it's actually quite good money. But also during the past few years, I've also noticed that a lot of people are also starting to have more children because of course, if you have more children and you're a resident here, even those kids get to have money. So this is one of the things that the locals are looking forward to each year. And today, I got my 
$9,000. And next month, April will get hers. They usually go according to age. The oldest people get them first and they start handing them out in July. And then it goes down to the youngest. So I'm sort of middle-aged. So I get mine in between. So I get mine in August. So um, usually when I get my money, I just put it aside in the bank. But for this year, we have to go to Spain in October for a wedding. One of my cousins is getting married in Spain and we are gonna use this money towards that. So anyway, that's me going off. So, God, I look hideous today. Well, I don't look hideous. It's the bloody background. You can't even tell whether I have hair. <laughs> it's like a bald, unbelievable. I'm gonna kill Graham. I suppose I shouldn't really mention that on camera <laughs> oops anyway so these are the mail that i will be opening today okay so these are the, my mail pile that i have put aside to open today so let us start with the smallest one this one is from my friend v in vegas so that is her envelope there. She also likes making her own envelopes. I'm not too sure what's inside this envelope, but I can feel it's a little bit bulky. Let's see what's inside. I'm gonna use my elephant letter opener today. So let's open this up. What did V came send me? Interesting. Purcell! Enjoy your sticky notes plus taco seasoning. Love ya, she says. I love you too, V. It is apparently a wish. Sticky notes and seasoning. Ooh. Taco seasoning mix. That looks very interesting. I've not seen this brand before, so this would be very interesting to try. And I have some beautiful sticky notes, unicorn types. Look at that. Thank you very much, V, and you know I love you too. <laughs> Next up is another one from the US. This is from Tammy Irwin. Right, let's see what Tammy Irwin sent me. Let's look at the notes. Travel brochure tag. Fun things to see and do in Kansas. Yeah, so she has sent me some travel brochures. Let's have a look. Nice. Best small towns in Kansas. Experience Marysville. Let's quickly just go through them. That is so cool. What else do we have here? Dodge City, Kansas. <laughs> Look at that. Oh man. Look at that. Good stuff. Last one we have. Ooh. Ho ho. This one I like. It's another colorful one, but not only that. First, let's flip to the back. Okay, so that's one side of it. That says Wamigo. Wamigo events and attractions. It's so cool. Ah, let's flip to the front. It says the land of Oz. Ah, I like this one. This is cool. Look at that. There's an Oz winery. There is a winery. Visit the tasting room to sample award-winning wines and browse wine accessories and gourmet products. I should go. I want to go. I want to go here. This is cool. Thank you very much, Tammy Irwin. I liked what you sent over. Now let's go to Mandy Abney. Take a look at these stamps. Apparently, these are the new American stamps. It is the scratch and sniff stamps. So what you do, of course, you scratch it and then you sniff it. Let's try it, let's try it, let's try it. It works! It actually works. Unbelievable. There are two stamps there. I haven't scratched the other one yet. I can't even tell what smell it is, but it just smells so nice and sweet wow how did i do that how did i make stuff like that okay so let us see oh i just noticed there's another one there there's another scratch and sniff these are cool let us see let us see this is a very very seasoning day 
awesome. Here is your wish for seasoning. Enjoy. So what do we have here? We have oh, this is cool. Let's, let's go to this one first. So I've got some more original taco seasoning mix. And we have chili seasoning mix. I love all things chili. I am a very very chili girl. I'm a very spicy girl. Yes, I am spicy. I am hot. I better schedule a day sometime this week to use up all these seasonings. Wow. Thank you very much, Mandy Abney. So kind of you. Well, this is working out very well. I thought I'd wear something different today. For a change, I thought I'd wear something Japanese y. But it's just not working out with my background, is it? God damn it, Graham! And look at my hair! Unbelievable. I I thought I thought I was gonna look absolutely beautiful in this one and that the color of this one would stick out but thank you Graham thank you for making that work for me with your New Zealand background anyway so next up we shall open something from Trinidad this is from Trinidad from Marlene Ramrup let's see what she sent me I'm just trying to see how long mail takes from Trinidad to here. I can't read the dates on that thing. Look, it doesn't really say. Please do not bend. Sorry, just kidding. All right, so let's see what this non-bendable product is that Marlene from Trinidad sent me. Da -da -da -da. Here comes the samurai sword. I should have used the samurai sword for my Japanese outfit. Ugh. And I thought I had this all planned out. Unbelievable. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so. And the mystery unfolds. Literally unfolds. <laughs> oh, let's see. Let me see. What is this? non-bendable product da -da -da -da. hiya hiya there hiya there Crystal. i like her note too it says there on the top you're sweet thank you hiya Crystal. enclosed you'll find the alphabet j tag jewelry nose gold chain is that nose or rose <laughs> nose gold chain journal just cause you like dream catchers, dream catchers, hey hey. Just, just cause, okay? Oh, and a few gift cards just because. Have a wonderful day, lovely person, you, Marla. Aww, I am having a wonderful day. Let's see what she said then. Ooh, this is nice. So these are some gift cards because you guys know I collect gift cards. So take a look at that. So Starbucks and Marriott. Where's this Marriott from? Marriott does not say which country. So Starbucks, Marriott, and another Starbucks. And look at this one, Starbucks, Florida. I don't have that, but that is so awesome. I cannot believe that each state has their own Starbucks card. This is just cool. Florida Starbucks, look at how cool that is. Anyway, so there's the Starbucks cards, just because. Journal and sticky notes. Ooh. That is so flowery. It has one mini journal and two mini sticky notes pad. Oh, those are the two mini sticky notes pad. Those leaves. Look at that. Oopsie. Let me remove it from its cover. Alright. So sticky note, sticky note, and the journal. It is blank inside. Cool stuff. And then, ooh. So this is not exactly Jay, but she says just because you like dream catchers. So I suppose that is acceptable for a Jay item, right? That is so cool. It's orange, as you can see. Thank you very much for this, Marla. Now let's go to the last product. So this is the jewelry. Okay, that's the jewelry. Notice how long this is. And remember what I said earlier? I thought it was a nose gold chain. So can you imagine if this is indeed a nose gold chain? Like where would I even hang it? You know, I have a very flat nose, right? So does it go here to go all the way down here? So it's like two in one. It's like a nose and a necklace. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> I know sometimes I don't have the best of handwritings, right? Because, you know, when I send out mail, I send them out in batches. So sometimes, you know, I just scribble and scribble and scribble and scribble. All right, so I'm not kidding. So let us go to... Look, Marla has good handwriting. I like her handwriting. It's nice and neat. Oh, it matches my outfit too. But <laughs> seriously, where is it? So that says jewelry, and it says there that's either an N or an R. And I thought it was an N. Anyway, this is cool. So it says, when I let go of what I am, I become what I might be. Hmm, huh, that is similar to a quote that I have read a few weeks ago on camera as well. This is very nice. Thank you very much for this beautiful long necklace, Marla. I like this. Thank god it's not a nose gold chain. <laughs> oh my god. So let's recap what we got from Marla. So we have this beautiful orange dream catcher, journal sticky notes, jewelry. All of these represent the letter J. And of course we have this beautiful Starbucks cards. Thank you very much. Very, very much appreciated. Okay, so that is it for me for today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me open this next batch of mail. And um, as usual, I still need subscribers. So I need you guys to share to your friends. Tell your friends that they need to watch me. They may or may not be interested, but tell them I'm awesome. Tell them, <laughs> tell them I need attention. Tell them I am an attention seeker. Please subscribe, please get your friends to subscribe, get everyone you know to subscribe to my channel, please. And um, I shall see you guys again. Goodbye! Graham! I'm done! You can take your New Zealand stuff off now! Please!